are you doing with your old bones? Your old bones. I'm in the middle of old bones right now. They're made completely new. I'm in the middle of what's known as the Limelight Marketplace. If the name Limelight sounds at all familiar to you, it's because you might have been a fan back in the 80s and 90s of the very famed Limelight Club right here in Manhattan. Limelight Club was made famous for sex and drugs. I guess they had all big names. And this was the place where all the partiers came together. I want to show you what this place looks like. I want you to use your imagination as you look around what used to be a, an old Gothic church. Think about how heavy, how frightening, how dark at some point it might have been. And also consider the fact that it was closed and run down. And yet, someone who had vision saw something in the old bones that he could literally revive and turn into what became a landmark in New York City. All right, even if it wasn't famous for great stuff. Take a look. Eventually, the limelight also fell into disrepair. The whole thing had a close up, went kapooey, and this place fell into disrepair yet again. But as recently as one year ago, another person saw the old bones in this place and saw it as a completely new concept. Now, the limelight marketplace is exactly that. If you want a great glass of wine, if you want to do some boutique shopping, if you want some of the best homemade chocolate chip cookies, if you need a place to go and get a bikini wax, if you need some custom-made clothes, jewelry, it is all here in this one place. And I don't know about you, but I think it's kind of funny that a former Gothic church would also be home a generation or two later to what's known as the Cana Wine Bar. So, so much for old bones. If you think you are living with your own old bones, I think it's time you could get a little inspired right here at the Limelight and come up with a new idea for your old bones today. Make them new. This has been Maura right here in Manhattan with Maura for you. Bye-bye.